small molecule drugs are usually designed to inhibit dysregulated proteins. Molecular glue degraders, on the other hand, remove the problematic proteins altogether by gluing them to a ubiquitin ligase, an enzyme of the cellular waste disposal system. The drug thalidomide, for example, induces the interaction of a ubiquitin ligase substrate receptor, CRBN, with a transcription factor called ecorose, which leads to ecorose ubiquitination and its degradation through the proteasome. Such molecular glue degraders can expand the repertoire of druggable proteins and effectively inactivate all functions of a given target, but remain difficult to design or identify. To discover new degrader molecules, we compare the cytotoxicity of existing drugs with the abundance of ubiquitin ligase components in cancer cell lines and found that the kinase inhibitor, CR8, preferentially kills cancer cells with high levels of DDB1, a known ubiquitin ligase adapter. We found that CR8 binds to the active site of CDK12 cyclin K, and this composite interface recruits the adapter protein, DDB1, and induces the formation of a functional CRL4 ligase complex. This leads to ubiquitination and degradation of cyclin K. This is different from the mode of action of thalidomide, which directly engages the E3 ligase to recruit substrate proteins. Riscovidin, a kinase inhibitor very similar to CR8, binds to CDK12 cyclin K, but does not induce cyclin K degradation. CR8, thanks to an additional solvent-exposed pyridyl moiety, shows the gain of function activity and can induce the recruitment of DDB1 and, subsequently, cyclin K degradation. Our work, therefore, supports a rational strategy to build compounds with molecular glue degrader activity by modifying solvent-exposed moieties of target-binding small molecules. We think that many other existing compounds have this molecular glue activity, and by altering the surface chemistry of the proteins that they bind to, such compounds can induce or stabilize many protein-protein interactions, not only with E3 ligases, but also with other proteins. For more details, please see our manuscript entitled The CDK Inhibitor, CR8, Acts as a Molecular Glue Degrader That Depletes Cyclin K.